Now, it might become a dud. The problem is the water flow of millions of gallons of Colorado River water hurtle through the Hoover Dam every day, generating electricity. The water levels behind the Hoover Dam are drying up amid a summer drought and are dangerously low to the point of becoming a dead pool, a problem for any place that relies on the dam's hydroelectricity. It had been a shining example of hydroelectric power, a key selling point of green energy. Now, it might become a dud. The problem is the water flow of millions of gallons of Colorado River water hurtle through the Hoover Dam every you can tell right down there by the arrow where it says share at all the, the levels there are in the sand and the, the rock, you know, from the sh from the tide. Look at all the rings from that, like a tree. You know what I mean? It's going down, bro. No more power, guys. Every day, generating electricity for hundreds of thousands of homes. Stagnant waters would create another stress on California energy shortages. Nevada and Arizona also get hydroelectricity from the Hoover Dam, which generates 4 billion kilowatt hours every year, enough to serve 1.3 million people. According to the U.S. Bureau of Reclamation, USBR, we it keeps messing up. We are in the 23rd year of drought here.